Introduced Bird Species to Southern Africa, Part 1 The common chaffinch was introduced to the Cape Town area by Cecil John Rhodes in about 1898. They have not spread very much and they are confined to mainly the exotic plantations in the Cape Town area. The natural distribution in Europe is the green area and the summer area is the yellow area above and below they were introduced to Cape Town, South Africa and New Zealand. The common miner was introduced in Durban in about 1900 and in Johannesburg in 1938. They were originally captive birds, but they were released by humans. They can be found across most of Southern Africa now. The blue area is the native distribution, and the red area is where they were introduced around the world. And in typical starling fashion, they can be seen in this picture looking for ticks and other insects on impala. So they are kind of doing some good in nature. The common starling was introduced to the Cape Town area by Cecil John Rhodes and they were released in that area in 1897. And they also picked ticks off cattle like the miners do. And in this distribution map the dark green is their native area and the yellow is where they spend summer and the blue area is where they spend winter where it's warmer and the light yellow and light green is where they were introduced worldwide. Unfortunately, these common starlings compete with our indigenous birds for nesting holes and they have spread across most of southern Africa now. The common peacock was introduced to Robben Island off Cape Town Port Elizabeth, which is now Gwebecha, and East London in about the late 1800s. Some were intentionally released and some were escapees. This is their original distribution in India. And this group is from the original peacocks that were introduced to a nearby mosque in the Port Elizabeth area but they are now thriving in the hospital grounds of St. George's Hospital, where they get fed. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and post any comments you have down below.